Hello, I'm going to go over how I model the L sound. And typically L is not something we work on for preschoolers, but a lot of preschoolers do have trouble with L. So if you are wanting to work on it at home, here are some easy strategies on how we can bring that attention to the right way to say it. Most preschoolers are probably making a W for an L. So instead of little, they're saying whittle. And they're doing that because if you look at someone's mouth, you can see their lips moving. They may not be attending to seeing that your tongue is moving. Another reason why could be their fine motor skills are just not mature enough. If that's the case, it may take a little more practice and maturity as they get older to get the L. But if they just need that kind of attend to your mouth, that's something you can work on. So the one thing I do is when I model it, I make sure I open my mouth really big so they can see that my tongue is lifting up. So it helps to smile or open your mouth. La. So I would really exaggerate it. Watch, when I say look, I use my tongue. Watch, look, and I lift my tongue up. And I usually just kind of point to it or I kind of lift my finger up, look. And you, if they're doing it and they're really moving their lips around, you can also um, stabilize their mouth or stabilize their jaw to show them I'm only using my tongue. Watch, I'm gonna open. La. And you can turn to the side and show them. La. And sometimes they can't do it in isolation like that, but they can do it when it's repetitive. So you could say, oh, it's just like this when I sing. La, 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 la. If they can imitate that, then I would start there and just change the vowel. Okay. La, 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 li, li, li. Now let's try a word. Leaf. Li, 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 leaf. So their tongue's already doing what it's supposed to, and then you can just kind of turn it into a word and then take away the repetition. Um, so that's for L at the beginning and the middle. So if you want them to say the word pillow, same thing. Oh, watch, I'm going to pop my mouth open, then I'm going to use my tongue. So just point out where in the word they need to use their tongue for their L. So pillow. And if they can't get it, if the other consonant is confusing them, I would take away the P in pillow and start with the L. So get them where they can do that automatically. Low, low. Now let's put it together. P, low. And just kind of use your hands to gesture just to bring that attention to their mouth. For L at the end of the words, it's the same thing. It's just a little more subtle. So you might need to exaggerate it or add a vowel at the end. So if it's the word pill, pill, they might not see your tongue moving. So you can kind of bring it out. Pill, pill. And you might need to add that vowel so they can get it there. Then kind of fade it away. So pill, pill. Once they do that, then you can, I usually say, let's say it fast. Pill, pill, I'm gonna move my tongue up quickly. And that's how you kind of fade away that vowel at the end. So good luck and message me if you have any questions.